dedicated to the studies. Huh? That statue. Seminary. Seminary. Wow. Very good. You teach, uh, what's that called? Uh, Entomology and the plant studies. Yeah. Botany. See where that field is? That's where the Pope came and spoke. But there was people all over. This is where the Pope came and talked in the Philippines. Another old building, huh? Oh, the oh this is a church. Okay. Oh, the church. Mm. No wonder the Pope came here, huh? He went inside too? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, this is the church. How old is the church? Same? 405 years old, huh? I don't know if you can see this, but this is all original stones. The same with the other building. Has, nothing has been renovated. When I go inside, I gotta ask and see if we can film it. We got a gift shop. Real nice stuff. Trying to sneak in a film in here. I don't know if you can see it because it's dark. Beautiful. This is where the Pope came and gave his mass, and then he went outside in the yard and spoke. I showed you earlier from a farther distance, but now it's closer. This is the, the field that you saw in the news if you saw it when Pope Francis was here. And there's the stage in the, in the background. But right now we're playing softball, women softball, or girls softball. Ah. Okay, this statue is dedicated to Mr. Benavides. Let's see what it says here. Which I might be able to, some of the words that I can read, they are the same as Spanish. Señor del Santimo Rosario, ni Obispo Miguel de Benavides. Okay. Looks like he founded this place when the Spanish Spaniards were here. Let me go around the other side. Was he a priest? Saint Thomas. Saint Thomas Aquinas. That's the the uh, Saint Thomas. But he's, he told me it was Benavides. Benavides. No, it's not Sam Thomas. Father away picture now. Maybe we can see the top. As I was saying before the battery died on me, brand new battery, and father shot so we can see the old building. The Quiapo Bridge. Pasig River. Pasig? The clean Pasig River. <laughs> it is clean. At least this area. <laughs> We're walking to Port Santiago after traffic in Manila. Of course, we have to pay before we get in. Here we are. And we'll see what's going on inside the park. We're going 
to this way to Fort Santiago Bay Resort Shrine. Of course, we get the typical gift shop in any government-owned park. So we can, on the way out, you can buy your souvenirs or whatever you want to get. A lot of kids here today. There's no school. 